safety man. And that's why. I should get it all. You got to get it all. World Cup final, England have won. Yes, it was only just scrambled away, and the shot back in was an absolute beauty. Scoring's in the attack as well, and has got a chance to shoot. There goes Fuller. Walker across. Goal kick. Three waving player. Glinsman, uh, one who does. Good opportunity for England here if he can get the ball in, but he couldn't. Tries a shot which is curving a bit. It took a deflection off uh, an England player in front of him. Spell of pressure. And Linick has come to the near post. Corner. The super move, David Black. The Germans won't make the quick break because we know how. Boom. Klinsmann's first touch really let him down there. Klinsmann, Gascoigne. Second time the ball has fallen to him in that inviting position. Trevor. What's the... Oh, and he's going to run for him, but here in support is Pierce. And after half an hour's play, perhaps a moment to bring in the injured England captain, Brian Robson, watching in London. But uh, I think there may have been a foul. Oh, and turned over, but it wouldn't have mattered. I was right, there was a foul. Gascoigne 70 in Mexico. I think uh, Chris Cody is close. Too. Now Algenthal is gone. Olaf Tone shot and well gathered by the Doyen of goalkeepers. So the top goal side for Germany. This is Matthias and caught by Paul Parker. But it's Algenthal who will hit it. What a shot and a good save! the highest order from Peter Shilton from Klaus Algenthaler. How well he drew. The ref's really done excellent. Let play go on a lot. And the referee brings the first half to an end with England being applauded off by their supporters and by many of the Italian, which had the Germans rocking back on there. Just a reminder to anybody that came in a little late that the return. Linick is in a great position square if he can find him. But he couldn't. Algenthaler came hurtling across to Olaf Tone, number 20. Good save, Shilton. And called upon again. Bookmark goes in. Good clearing header by Mark Wright, facing his own goal. Pulled it back for Olaf Tone to shoot. You need to make a bit of noise now because the English defence, because in that first period when they weren't getting the men forward. Run by Hessler. The challenge was by Pierce. And the referee was on the spot. Bobby Robson will be aware. And it's been deflected, and it's in the net! Bremer's shot! And I think it must have hit Paul Parker. I'm sure that span off Paul Parker and beat Peter Shilton in the most and they're buzzing Trevor oh, Pierce was there oh so close Stuart Pierce was it a penalty was it a penalty no it wasn't I'm being a bit too hopeful really there wasn't much of an appeal instead Stephen he's just come on side was there in the middle Trevor just Gascoigne in a good position here Pat's in there too but Paul Gascoigne heads it wide it is a trouble Algenthaler couldn't do it Lineker probably could and England have equalised it's Gary Lineker the ace marksman keeps England in the World Cup with just 10 minutes to go it's his 35th goal for England, and who's to say it's not his most important? And referee Wright of Brazil ends the 90 minutes, and England and West Germany, as they did in 1966 and in 1970, go into extra time in the World Cup. The England flags are being...
Desmond or, or not, but um, <laughs> we don't rule it out. I don't think the England team have ever been involved in a penalty competition, and uh, I should think if it happened in the West left, left the field in the second half injured. Matt and Minica waiting in the centre, but uh, that was behind the line, was it? Before, well, corner given. Reuter. Klinsman, great save, Shilton. Terrific goalkeeping on the line. A dangerous position inside left. Klinsman missed it. Wonderful chance. Away, and I do honestly think that not Beckenbauer's to say. Tone. Tone has been more evident, really, than uh, Matthiasen. It's a very, very powerful run by Buchwald. Waddle. Can he square it for Lineker? Waddle shoots. Oh, and the rebound off the post. Just beat David Platt. Because uh, he'd stood the referee on the halfway line and was... Oh. Dear me. Bremer, yellow card, without a doubt, foul on Gaskell. Offside, David Platt. So the roar is stuck in the throats of the England... And Platt has made a few very telling runs and got himself into some extremely good position. Olaf Tone curled it and Peter Shilton made another important save. And it's Bremer again, Bremer! Oh, what a shot! That was like a missile. Uh, in our conversation anyway, it may have changed, but he... Lineker's waiting in the middle. Oh, and Ilbner was struggling to get the ball around for a corner. Buchwald hits the post! They've both hit the post now. Matthias. Berthold. It's penalties. Jose Wright of Brazil signals that... So it will go down as a 1-1 draw, this semi-final, and someone will lose on the penalty shootout. Hope for the best. Here he goes, and he blasts it, and England have drawn first blood. He repeat the feat here, he can't. Isley for England, yes! Penalty man, and that's why. I should think in league football, and uh, he's done it for England. So it's 3 2 and nearer. Riedler. Oh, and he's hit it too straight. And West Germany find it. And he's put it away. And there it is. Oh dear, it's West Germany. The favourites have got through by the narrowest of margins. The favourites have got through by the narrowest of margins. They've reached a third consecutive World Cup final of 1966, ended by penalty failure. Fortune and a fair amount of skill and nerve from the penalty spot for Franz Beckenbauer and his players. And for England...